What's up, motherfuckers? I am Mother Schwarzenegger, and I am here to tell you that I'm back after being the governor and returning to the Expendables 2. I now have my first starring role since my shitbag movie, Terminator 3. Yes, me, Arnold Schwarzenegger, has actually admitted it. Now, we are gonna go to 22 Tiger Dude to review my movie, The Last Stand, and I hope he fucking likes it. So please, enjoy this review, motherfuckers. I'll be back! Hello everyone! I am 22 Tiger Dude! Wait, what the fuck? And I'm here to review The Last Stand, and I'm gonna say it in the order that the trailer should have said it, because, yeah, it stars how the trailer should have done it in order, Arnold Schwarzenegger, Forrest Whitaker, Luis Guzman, and... Johnny Knoxville. The trailers only said Arnold Schwarzenegger and Johnny Knoxville. And out of everyone, Johnny Knoxville had the minor part. He was only in the beginning and the final 30 minutes of the movie. That's really it. But anyways, The Last Stand, it's Arnold Schwarzenegger being back. It's his first star in role since Terminator 3. And, of course, he was technically back for Expendables 2, but this is like his combat movie, like his actual star movie, to come back as the Arnold Schwarzenegger that we love, and he's the only actor that works at making bad movies, but fun bad movies. So, how is The Last Stand? Well, Arnold Schwarzenegger plays a sheriff. There's this guy named Gabriel Cortez. He writes this little vehicle, and... Ar and he's going to the Mexican border, so it's up to Arnold Schwarzenegger to uh, stop him from crossing the Mexican border, and just more things like that. The plot's pretty simple and basic. And this is from a Korean director, The Last Stand. And I thought how this Korean guy directed it, he did a really well done job. The Last Stand is a fun, good movie. It's not meant to be nominated at the Oscars whatsoever. It's just a fun, time of a movie to escape from the harsh and horrible reality for one hour and 40 minutes. So it is a fun time and it's meant to be dumb because yes, this is a dumb fun movie. Some of the lines they say are so bad that it's so hilarious and the action sequences were fun, a few unnecessary bloody scenes, but it's supposed to be over the top that way and Arnold Schwarzenegger, it was just so good to see him back. Too bad he didn't get to say, I'll be back! But he uh, he was still being Arnold Schwarzenegger, even though he was old. And yes, you do see him get up. He's not the he's not the big, strong one that he was. Like, he's still strong, but we still see him having a hard time getting up and all that stuff with his old age now. And I thought that was just handled so well. Johnny Knoxville... Even though he wasn't in this movie much, I still thought he was funny and good for the part he was brought in. Luis Guzman. Man, Luis Guzman. He was so funny here. Luis Guzman, Johnny Knoxville are the ones that definitely stole the show in terms of the comedy. Because they were both funny. Luis Guzman really cracked me up. And he actually fit the role in this movie here well. So he did a very damn good job. Uh, the acting overall is pretty good. Um, there is a few bad acting, like Genesis Rodriguez from Casa de Mi Padre. Um, uh, her acting was pretty bad here. Her acting in Casa de Mi Padre was better. Um, Gabriel Cortez's uh, is acting, yeah, that that was not very good. And Forrest Whitaker, I haven't seen him in a while, but pretty good to see Forrest Whitaker again. And I thought he did a very good job for what role he had. And it was just well written in terms of a fun action movie with bad lines and just funny moments because I laughed a lot. I really had a lot of fun with The Last Stand. And it's not a perfect movie. I didn't want it to be a perfect movie. When I was looking for this movie, I did not want a perfect action movie. All I wanted was a fun a fun action movie. That's exactly what I got from this film. It's stupid fun, but you know what? That's what it's all about when it comes to Arnold Schwarzenegger. And the Arnold Schwarzenegger fans will definitely be pleased with this film. 
and because it's just so much fun. It's so stupid, but uh, I don't know what else to say. I just really, really had a ton of fun with The Last Stand. I really want to buy it on DVD when it comes out because that's a movie... A uh, fun action movie I could watch over and over again. It's just a fun damn movie. And Arnold Schwarzenegger is going to tell you what I rate The Last Stand. 22 Tiger Dude gives The Last Stand. 3 at the first stars. Fuck yeah, motherfucker. Yeah! Subscribe to my channel. Comment below and give me your opinion of the film. Like and share this video. I hope you enjoyed this. And don't forget that I will always have Tiger Power.